Now over to Agawam, where a local woman is selling wreaths this holiday season. The proceeds will go towards organizations that help restore the lives of victims of sex trafficking. Western Mass News reporter Perseida Londa Verde has more on the mission behind this wreath giving. And the idea that a child can be sold for money is just heartbreaking. So we do what we can. Six years ago, Marianne Dietschler, an Aguam resident, founded Wreaths with a Reason. She tells Western Mass News she started with the mission to create at least one wreath a month and have the money go towards an organization that helps survivors of sex trafficking. That mission has since grown. Six years later, I'm selling probably 30 wreaths a month. I have five volunteers that work with me. And so far, we've sent $80,000 to rescue women and children from sex trafficking. One local volunteer shares with us why she got involved. I just can't imagine if that was my life, that I would hope that there would be people out there helping to free me from that life. And the wreaths are not just for this holiday season. They are made year-round. Even St. Patrick's Day, Valentine's Day, Easter, spring, summer, any holiday, Veterans Day, we make wreaths. All the proceeds from the wreaths will go towards two organizations, Operation Underground Railroad and Amira. We will probably send about $5,000 to the charity. We use a God-given talent and I put it to use, not for my benefit, but to help others. And Dietzler says the wreaths can be ordered online and shipped to your home, or she can deliver locally. But if you'd like to pick up from right outside of her home, she has a contactless option. For more information, head to westernmassnews.com. For now, reporting in Aguam, Brisa Delanda Verde for Western Mass News.